Welcome to Gaya Kaur Lesson for the song Bonza Ra from the movie Ek Billion, composed by the Mithun Chakravarti and this is the Kepo version for the beginner who feel difficult to use the bar chord and if you use the Kepo, if you put the Kepo in the 4th fourth, fourth fret then the all chord becomes simple uh, C sharp minor, the original scale of the chord is C sharp minor and the C sharp minor becomes A minor and A becomes F and B becomes G and G sharp minor become E minor and E become C. Let's check out the chord again. You should know the A minor, F, G, E minor, E and C. Let's check out the string pattern also. If you are the beginner, then just do the simple string pattern. Uh, at first, when the chord started, uh, song started, you can give only the down stroke only. And uh, after that, uh, when there is the actual beat, uh, the song is in the beat of the drum beat, then you can use down, 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 mute. And count it as 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. In the first one, only down stroke, and the second two, down, down, and, and the third mute, and fourth rest. 1, 2, 3, 4. Down, 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 mute, down. Down, down, mute. Down, 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 mute. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. I think you have got it. Now let's check out the chord progression of the song using the from the first to the last. And in the intro and the first section of the song, the chord is very simple and the chord progression is also simple. And the when the uh, song is started with the piano piece, you can use the A minor and F with a just down stroke only. Uh, from the lyric start, this is in the game. You should play A minor and F for four times then B, then G for 4 times, then F for twice, then again G and E for one one time. Don't be confused, I will still playing the backing track. Just uh, try to memorize the chord here uh, so that you, you feel comfortable when you're playing the backing track. Uh, let's revise the chord. A minor and F for 4 times, then G for 4 times, then F for twice, then again G and E for one one time. Then this is Sayariki Ghazal from that uh, part. A minor for twice, F for twice, and G for twice, and again A minor. Like this. 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. I think you have got. Second song is started from the C chord. I suggest you to note down the chord because uh, there is not the regular progression, and you may feel difficult uh, while uh, singing while I'm playing with the backing track. Now check, uh, let's check out the chord C and E minor for one one time, and again repeat it. Then F G for one one time. Then again C for two times. Now let's revise C and E minor for one one time and again repeat it. Then F for one time, G for one time and again C for one time. I think I would got the chord progression. And this whole chord progression is repeated again. And the next part comes with the E, A minor for one time, F 
and G. E, A minor, F and G for one one time. And again G for two time. And A minor for two time. Like this. E. Then F and G for. Again G for two time. Then A minor. Then Kishi Sire ka gazal part start like the chord in the previous part. A minor for twice, F for twice, G for twice, and again A minor for twice like this. similar in the song 3 also as to as song part 2 and thanks for watching my video and please do not forget to share comment like and please do not forget to subscribe and if you feel uh, difficult on uh, learning my teaching style then please comment in the comment box I'll change my teaching style from the next time uh, thanks for watching again and please do not forget to comment like share thank you